hello everybody welcome to my channel today in this video i show you how to use loose less scaling app okay so with the help of loose less scaling you can make your fps better but it will decrease the resolution okay on the lower resolution you can play the game and by upscaling it you will get the same fps okay so it is available on steam you can buy you can buy it on steam or there may be certain uh, repacks or other on the external website you can download from there also and uh, for the first game i'm gonna try is gta 5 so i have already played gta 5 in the native settings and i will just so now i show you how to increase your fps okay so you just extract it or you just download it from steam and just now you see your a loosely scaling application so just double click on it so it uh, this will appear okay so make sure you keep the settings same as mine okay clip cursor on adjust cursor speed on don't do other things on and just choose amd fsr keep set it and default okay so the sharpness you can see you can keep it to four or three okay you can choose four or three right now i will choose three okay you can keep four also because the last time i hit played gta 5 and 4 so what i am going to do now is now i need to open gta 5 in window mode okay so i'm going to be in window mode like uh i just go to my game settings and you can see now i go to graphics full screen borderless window window mode i just keep the resolution either to 720p or 1366 okay it's your choice like i just keep it to 280 by 720 and just need to apply you can see apply 
Uh, now the users go back to the app okay lose the scaling app if you are unable like you can see that my my mouse is stuck here so what i'm going to do is open task manager by pressing ctrl alt delete and going to the lose list app now you can see the task manager is open but we do not do anything in a task manager now just go to the app okay just click on scale and just immediately go to the game before this time runs to zero you can play the game you can see my fps it is so high but uh, there will be some drop down on the graphics okay you can see the last time graphics they were not as astonishing as this one but you will be definitely getting higher fps uh, i will give you a note that the higher row graphics card okay so this trick is working for all graphics card all graphics card but if your graphics card is higher like mine is 2060 it is running now 3060 40 40 s yes, 40 90 has already arrived and 2060 will be down within a few years but if you have a 1650 super or 1650 ti or whatever either your pc graphics card or laptop graphics card it does not matter this tricks works for all okay so you can use it get better fps you can see my fps is good now i'm getting good like 160 120 it is not dropping down to 100 as before so right now i have tested it at 720p if you can also put it to 13 36 into 768 if you have a 1080p monitor or 1080p display okay because if you do it at 1366 then it will make your graphics much better okay so the last time it just so drum down to 92 we will test other games also So this is it for this one okay and you can see also my you can see the cpu temperature gta 5 usually consumes more cpu temperature by the way mine is Lenovo Legion 5 2020 and uh, it usually goes to like 80 85 on normal usage right now i'm playing is balance mode if i just turn on performance mode now you can see there is some 2060 okay the 88 but the cpu temperature is still 78 79 as before